everybody and welcome back to some more oxygen not included over here in funky town We've got some issues we gotta deal with today Hopefully as always you guys enjoy if you do make sure to let me know by leaving a like leaving a comment Leaving something so I've been getting a ton of feedback on these videos, which has been awesome Unfortunately, most of them have been pre-recorded. So I've recorded all these videos uh, Like several days before you guys see them so I can't really enact the advice you guys are giving me which stinks But I'm starting to catch up now. So we're gonna start uh, using some advice that we're getting in the comments, especially my main man Logan has been giving me a ton of help in the game Kind of explaining a lot of the new things that have been introduced since I started playing. Hey, right, why do I have? Oh, this one's supposed to not have organic. I don't know why I just made that one without organic. Yeah, all right These all should be not organic. There we are All right guys, so we've got a power problem I want to deal with today because we are not really generating enough power to kind of keep up with everything uh, We've built our algae distiller so we could begin turning some of this slime into algae Just to make sure we don't run out kind of future proofing ourselves right now because we currently do have uh, 8.9 tons of algae and there's still a bunch up here a bunch down here So we still have a decent amount that we can mine. I'll probably stay out of for soon because apparently yeah, these places are riddled with germs, slime lug germs. Okay. Yeah, we, we definitely want to stay away from those. So we kind of want to make sure that we are ready and prepared to accept those germs when they do come along. But in order to get ourselves prepared for the power situations, actually cancel that. I just want to delete buildings here. Nope. I just want to delete buildings. Come on. There you go. All right. Get rid of that. And then we're going to start digging this stuff out. Uh, because I do want to make this our main power area. Maybe not our, our um, treadmills, but we'll probably put... Uh, actually, wait, we got to start research too. I got a bunch of things on my mind I want to try and do today. Internal combustion. Let's get a coal generator and maybe a hydrogen generator going. So we do technically have hydrogen out... I thought we had hydrogen. Oh, this is hydrogen. Okay. Is it? Yeah, this is all hydrogen. So technically, we could go up here and build a hydrogen generator. That actually wouldn't be bad. This wouldn't be the how to get to. We just build a couple of airlocks up here. And did I ever get this thing working? I don't remember. <laughs> uh, yeah, it looks like it's working. Or is the stuff just going behind it? No, the stuff's just going behind it. Yeah, we need to rebuild that. That's okay. We can just let it go for now. Uh, water and polluted water is looking okay. And overall, our oxygen is not, it's not terrible. But it's also not great. Oh, and we're going to have to start getting down here to deal with this stuff. Yeah, that's going to be an issue. So let's go ahead and plop a ladder right there. Because uh, we got to be able to access this water. So, uh, let's do that too. Because, yeah, they're out there. So we actually can't access water right now. So this is kind of an emergency. Oopsie daisy. So we need a pitcher pump. Let's see. Can we put it... Uh... Ah, man. That's not really going to work. Okay, here. Let's just do this. Let's get rid of this. Get rid of that plate, these guys. Let's go ahead and prioritize it. And yeah, people have been telling me, hey, don't forget to prioritize things. And I really should. I just haven't gotten around to it. But we'll go ahead and start doing that here. Let him go. Cody's going to knock out this floor. Okay, and while he's doing that, we can also get uh, the pitcher pump. Wait, we can't put it there? Oh. Well, that's kind of annoying. Yeah, I did not make this tall enough, unfortunately. <laughs> Uh, will they still really cross this gap? Because I'm pretty sure they can walk on top of- Yeah, they can walk on top of the pitcher pump. We found that out over here. So once they get that going, they can start harvesting some of this water. I mean, this water is 90 degrees, so it's a little bit warm. Uh, let's see, what's the temperature in here? I mean, it's 77, so this water should cool off. It's just because it's coming from this geyser. So eventually, we'll be able to research things that will control the temperature of the water as we pipe it through. Let's see, where would that be? Sensors. I've been told these exist. Improve proof plumbing. Look what shut off hydro sensor. Uh no. Temperature modulation. Here we go. It's way under liquid tuning. Uh cools liquid pipe through it, but outputs heat in its immediate vicinity. And then warms large bodies of water. Okay, so that must be for like the more icy biomes that we got going coming up here. Well, I really want to get some more power going through these generators because we have, uh, what do we have for coal? Consumable ore. We have 14 tons of coal. And I'm pretty sure there's a bunch more in here. That's obsidian. Where is, where is the coal? It's down here. Absolite. Obsidian. Coal, coal, coal. Where have I begun the coal? It's got to be somewhere. <laughs> it's got to be somewhere around here. Okay. Everybody go to sleep. And I should actually be able to deconstruct if we do liquid pipes. Behind this thing. Then maybe they'll just automatically start using the uh, liquid valve. We can shut that off right away. Liquid valve, go and turn that off. Another duplicate. Nope. 
I'm gonna reject them. Reject all. I don't even care how cool your hair is and how magnificent your sideburns are there, Harold. You're gonna get on up out of here. Because we are running a little bit behind in terms of production and food. I mean, we only got 12,000 kilocalories. Yeah. Hurry up. Okay, I, sh I should probably speed up. I'm tired of all the sleeping, guys. How are we doing on stress? Stress 3%. That's fine. Waffle. You're good to go. Oh, and I completely forgot that we do now have mesh tiles. Or sorry, airflow tires. These these used to be called uh, gas permeable tiles, so they're different. But we do have those now, so we can actually start spacing those out through here. Uh, if we need to start dropping our CO2 and raising our oxygen, but I don't really think we need to right now. Research complete? Good. Well, that frees up them. So we have two people that are kind of busy with research when they're researching stuff, believe it or not. So we're going to leave that off right now just so we can keep our power generation up and get all this stuff dug out and built and mopped up. I forgot there's water here. Going to have to mop that up. But I think we've we've really helped our polluted oxygen situation because previously we had a decent amount of polluted oxygen. And I know I've had some... For some reason, I keep saying terms incorrectly. I keep mixing up polluted oxygen and blah, 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 polluted oxygen and I think carbon dioxide. I don't know why I do that, but polluted oxygen is given off stuff by like uh, the polluted water and these organic storage containers, and polluted oxygen is what's filtered out by these deodorizers, which have been doing work. I mean, it's looking a heck of a lot better in here. So hopefully we can keep that up. Hmm, decent amount of oxygen around here. It still said, oh no, it doesn't say uh, our oxygen production is not high enough. Good. Good, good, good. And we got the CO2 down here. That's really not bad. This used to be CO2. Oh, I guess we we, pop, we popped a hole here, so it kind of all dropped down. That explains that. And I have been warned to make sure we're keeping an eye on the temperature over here. Yeah, it's starting to get a little warm. Oh, it's 100 degrees over here. Oof. Got to make sure these guys are okay. Are these guys growing? Let's see. Uh, yep. Growth halted. Temperature. Already getting a little toasty in here. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Okay, let's actually tear out these things. You can struck, no, all, all, all these. Get rid of these, there we go. And I'm gonna move the uh, micro musher and the ration boxes down here. I mean, they should be down there anyway. Or frankly, should we even have any ration boxes? Not sure. Uh, let's go ahead and just get rid of these. And rebuild them down here. So hopefully they'll move stuff from the ration box over here into the refrigerators. Let's go ahead and get a micro musher right there. And yeah, we shouldn't need the ration box. Okay. And let's wire all this up. Now, can we get this stuff? Um, mechanized airlock, blah, blah, blah. Functions as many other. Because I'm worried, is the heat coming through here every time this thing is opened? Ooh, oh wait, let's see. Was this fixed? No liquid output. Yeah, so this is stopping everything, right? Oh, wait. <laughs> Okay, or we just messed up the pipes in a way that it doesn't function anymore. Uh, did we get this right? Yeah, white in, green out. There we go. That should fix that. Okay, and for temperature, yeah, if we do like a bunch of doors here, I wonder if that'll help. No, because I mean, it's, it's just radiating out through here. Hmm. Uh, looks like we do have insulated tiles, so that would really help that. Let's go ahead and try and research that. Uh, ba -ba -ba, temperature modulation. Yep, let's go ahead and do that one. That one should be quick. And with that, we'll get the hydrofan and space heater if we need, if we really need it. Because I really want to stop this heat from seeping in over here. It's, it's so weird, because look, that's... Trinium. So this is the temperature of everything. And there's random, like, green and a blue mark here, which is cold and very temperate right underneath this. Or maybe because it's in immeasurable? Sure, why it's doing that, huh? I do. I really don't like this. The fact that they have to hop down here just to cross it. Hup, pump that. Hop back up. That's kind of ridiculous. I'm not a big fan of that. Oh, but I even see that we had all this set up, so we can go ahead and mop all this up. There we go. And yeah, we'll set this up for regular tile down here. There to there. Yeah, let's get that built. And then in terms of power, we can get um. Guess we can do a coal generator way down here. I really don't like the idea of using the coal generator, but we kind of need to. We're, we're not really. Is did someone fall asleep down? Oh, dang it. Potato fell asleep in the water. Waffle's having a hard time mopping it up by himself. Wake up, Potato. <laughs> I really don't like mopping stuff up. It's clean water. I really don't know what their problem is. Oh, we don't have a bottle emptier here, but they. Sh I mean, 
this water, they should just be able to take it directly to the algae terrariums and stuff that requires water. That should be okay. Uh, we're reaching mass gas pressure. Huh. Well, at least they'll, the, they should automatically shut off when they reach maximum pressure, right? Yeah. That should be fine. Oh, and we are out of mush bars. So, what do we have in terms of cooking ingredients? We don't really have much. So these guys have, Oh, yeah, we got meal lice here. Uh, we really need to sweep all this stuff up because it's going to go bad. So, meal lice, let's go ahead and sweep all this up. And then prioritize. Yeah, I should have already made that the top priority. Okay, uh, let's do some lice loaf. Continuous. And they already have mush fry and pickled meal going on there. So, well, let's get to cooking, guys. See, that's the thing. I really could use some more people just to kind of deal with all this stuff. But the more people we have, the harder th it's going to be just to feed everyone and produce enough oxygen. And, I mean, he's almost... Oh, Waffle was about to finish researching and he fell asleep. Classic Waffle. Now he's pooping. Hey, look at him in there. Look at him. Hiding in his shame. I fell asleep while doing my work and now I can't stop pooping. Oh, who's getting... Zaborg's getting stressed out, huh? That's everyone's problem. What's... What's... What's wrong with you? Mm, details. Uh, stats. Info. It should tell me here what's wrong with him. Stress. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with him. These are set to, uh, 20, right? Yeah, so if anyone reaches 20, they should get a massage. Maybe because they were down here in the water. They really don't like getting wet. I mean, they're not hungry. They got plenty of oxygen. Uh, everybody's immune system is at 100%. Hmm. Building likes resources. Okay. Yes. Yeah, it just needs slime. That's because we're not even using it yet, so that's that's okay. I want to get this stuff built up first. And I didn't bother deleting that, because might as well use the oxalate, right? Might as well. As long as they're actually sweeping this stuff up. That's what I'm worried about, because it's unrefrigerated. Sweep task assigned. Let's see. Jobs. Let's take someone and just have them basically just sweep. Uh, these guys are... They're all runners. Wow. Okay, Cody. I'm just going to have you sweep, dude. That's all you're going to do in the morning, okay? Because I want to get this stuff all swept up. Then you're allowed to sleep anyway. <laughs> it feels so bad for him. we got to get him his own bed. Poor Cody. Oh, he has his own bed. I'm in his own bedroom. You know what I meant. All right, so he should start sweeping. Which one's Cody? I don't even remember. Oh, yeah, there's Cody. Oh, look at him go. It's strange. Why is he not prioritizing the things I actually prioritized as number one? That's so odd. All right, but now we have the... Uh, insulated tiles. What do these require? Okay, obsidian and, and just rock, granite, and sandstone. Okay, yeah. So we can just use whatever we got. Uh, raw mineral. We got the most of sandstone. Okay. So let us start insulating the crap out of this. Just try, try and keep this heat back from creeping in. Oh, uh, let's like, hold on, cancel that. That feels kind of like a waste of space. Let's do it back here. There. And there. Just to try and stop it a little bit. See if that helps. Because right now... Yeah, or maybe we could do the edge there. I don't know. Ah, we'll see if this helps. Look at him go. No one sweeps like Cody. He's a madman. Look at him. He's sweeping like no one's ever swept in their lives. Okay, what is this? Inefficient mush bars. Mush fries. Yeah, okay. We don't want mush bars. We want to use actual micro... Er, not the mush... Uh, pickled meal. There we go. That's a much better meal. Believe it or not... They'd rather eat an actual plant than dirt. Shocking, to say the least. I know, I, you, you, could, you don't have to tell me that, man. I was shocked to hear that. What do you mean, dirt's great? I need tons of dirt. Empty pump. Yeah, we can probably get rid of this soon enough. Cancel that. Can't, 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 cancel that. There we go. Can't even reach it. Well, technically, they can now, but whatever. And I want to make sure temperature down here is not getting too crazy. It's getting a little high. Mmm, trying to think if we could like enclose this with some of those insulated tiles. I don't think it's necessary right now. In fact, it should be cool enough because we're not even pumping in more water here, right? Yeah, it's sitting at 91, 91.1. Come on, go down. Go down. You can do it. Uh, 91, there we go, yeah. So the temperature is kind of going down now that we're not pumping in this boiling hot water anymore. Oh, it's already getting kind of high. That is a lot of water. I kind of like that, because I used to run out of water all the time in this game. It drove me crazy. New duplicates again. Cosmic Nicola, Ada. Get on out of here. I spit on you. Okay, I'm not going to build this over here. Just let this oxalite do its thing. And... Okay, you got to build in this, guys. Please. want to start generating some coal. Uh, did we run a wire down here? Yeah, we already ran a wire down here. 
That's right. I mean, the batteries are doing okay. We just could get so much more done if these guys didn't need two of them on pretty much all day, every day. Saves them a lot of time and effort. Well, speaking of which, I don't know why I never put... Let's go ahead. Where is it? Ventilation, plumbing. Uh, oxygen. There we go. Deoxidizers down here. I mean, these things are giving off all the uh, polluted oxygen, so... Makes sense that we should probably get those going. Uh, we can get rid of that one. Just because we don't really need it up here. We don't really have any polluted oxygen making its way down here. Hopefully this will kind of uh, negate any polluted oxygen that is created. Yes, quite very good. Oh, ho, okay. Call generate inf insufficient resources. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. The mass was delivered was too low. Is it not producing power? Yeah, it's doing okay. We've got plenty of coal. The coal's all up here. We currently have 14.8 tons of it. So hopefully some will deliver some more soon. And this thing, oh, it produces heat and exhaust. The exhaust is CO2, right? I'm pretty sure. So we could actually put some algae terrariums down here to try and convert that. And if it starts kicking off too much heat, uh, we can do some insulated tiles. Uh, they're just kind of ugly looking. Okay, let's see how this temperature is doing. Can't really, really tell a difference. Hopefully it's okay. Uh, let's see. It's 87 degrees in here. It's not that hot. 88 degrees. Plants can't grow in that heat. Not even hot, man. I'm from the desert. That's not hot. I love how this little shine bug is always in Potato's room. It's like his little pet. Good job, Potato. Sleep, my beauties. Waffle, Potato, Zarbug, White, Caden, and Cody. You know what? Cody's been good. Let's get him his own bedroom. Let's see. Temperature over here. Yeah, it's a little bit warm. Where should Cody sleep? It's not bad. It's only 80 degrees. He'll be fine. We, we can have him sleep over here. So, Cody, uh, take out that bed. Build one over here. Build one there. Let's get rid of that, too. And then we can do the tiles down like so. Like so. Pneumatic door there. And there. Ooh, and can't forget his little flower pot. Yeah, this place is looking kind of ugly. Uh, we don't have any artists yet. Mm, we could research that. See if we get some art going. Hopefully make people a little bit happier. There we go. Cody. There's your cot. And now he should have an actual bedroom. Huzzah! Yay! And we have one more bar. See, look at that. It's like fate or something. Something magical. Okay, so we have the battery recharge threshold. So should this thing be higher? This is basically says, uh, duplicates will operate this generator when battery charge falls below this selected percentage. So let's do like 75%. And then we're going to get rid of one of these. Just so hopefully we can free them up a little bit. And then we do have hydrogen up here. So I'm kind of tempted to build over into here and then get a hydrogen generator. Because we already have a wire line. Uh, let's see, power. Hydrogen generator converts hydrogen gas into electric power. I mean, there's a decent amount in here. There's even more up there. Hmm. So we could start just pumping in the hydrogen manually. That always gets tricky, though. I really don't want to get hydrogen in my base. I mean, it rises to the top, so that's kind of easier. But still. All right, he's actually delivering the coal. All right, there we go. Woo! Heat production, yeah, yeah. Water is 600 watts. Not bad. Hopefully it doesn't overload our batteries. Is that a thing? Will they explode? I just realized that. I <laughs> uh, hope not. Maybe that's what the purpose of the threshold is. Alright, insufficient meal lice. Okay, we're gonna have to go back to... Uh, mush bars. Continuous mush bars. And mush fry. Make that continuous. Okay. And we got our algae deoxidizer. Sorry, our uh, deodorizers down here. Uh, they should be dealing with some of this polluted oxygen, but we're doing okay. We got some little spots of CO2 kind of skipping around. That's okay. Yeah, we're actually reached in mass pressure. We're doing okay, guys. I'm pretty happy with how this place is going right now. Like it's not the, I know it's not the most beautiful and perfect colony, but it's mine. It's funky. It's funky town. Oh, Cody's got his bedroom. He's so happy. He's a happy Cody. Yeah, especially with this weird waterfall feature we had over here. <laughs> Hey, we got some stress. Cody, looking a little bit stressed, buddy. Okay, oh, this is break is at 50. No, let's get this down to... You know, I don't want to take any chances. 13%. 13% stress. You guys go... Just get a massage, okay? Why are you on there, Waffle? Cody's got the highest stress, you jerk. 
Yeah, you know, freaking guy. Okay, and then we have, um, looks like something here is polluting. Yeah, I think there's some polluted water sitting there. So they'll, they'll take that and uh, dump it out into here eventually. Oh, Cody is still only sweeping. And I think everything that needs to be swept has been swept. So, Cody, you can go back to doing whatever you want. Food shortage. Achi mama. Let's go ahead and prioritize cooking. Yep. Bump this up. Food shortage. Is that what it's yelling me about? Yep, 6,000 kilocalories available. We're on it, buddy. You guys start working. Get it going. I think we got enough dirt here. And I really want to see what's in here. We're going to start excavating. Yep, probably shouldn't, but I really want to see what's in here. Oh, there's slime and stuff here. So what can, what can we do to deal with these germs? Uh, we have the things like where we, the wash stations. Where are those? Uh, ba ba ba. Refinement. refinement. So these remove some germs from the duplicates. So, yeah, they'll pass it. Whenever they pass it, they'll use it. So, yeah. I said we I said we put it down here. Just so every time they go past this, they'll wash themselves. That should help. <laughs> Maybe, hopefully. And then we'll dig all this stuff out. Kind of make our way down to whatever this structure is. Because I really want to see what's going on here. And then a ladder to the front door. <laughs> oh, no. These guys are screwed. Okay. Oh, no. Nope, didn't mean to hit that. I dig down there, please. There you go. Don't get stuck up there, guys. Yeah, not a lot of air down here, so this might take a while for them to dig through. Take your time, guys. Don't you worry. Run back up here. Get some oxygen if you need it. No, don't get stuck over there, fools. Oh, my God. Whoa, whoa. Oh. Okay, so what is this? Neural vacillate vacillator? Oh, okay, a massive synthetic brain suspended in saline solution. Oh, geez, hold on. They are stuck. They are stuck. Okay, can you guys build up like this? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, guys. I need to come build for them. Okay, they're actually building now. <laughs> Quickly. <laughs> Quickly! Hopefully this actually works. Okay. Woo! Okay, that was almost really bad. Okay, so what does this thing do? Oh, there's a... Uh, Chair attached to the device for room with one person. With room for one person. So we gotta strap one of our people into this thing? A massive synthetic brain? What? Okay, uh, here we got some dust caps and some lockers. We can rummage around in them. Up here we got a light fixture. And a security door. Current state locked. Oh, well then can't cancel this. Yeah, screw that. Uh, you can get rid of that too. Oh no, the door's locked. What are we gonna do? Good thing there's not a giant hole in the roof. This is cool, man. Shouldn't we strap someone into this? <gasps> I have no idea what it's going to do. I kind of want to do it. <laughs> All right, let's see. Germs. Yeah, this is pretty germy down here. Pretty, pretty germy. Uh, I'm getting a little worried that they're going to get sick from that. So let's go ahead and get a med bed set up. Uh, roof. What, what does the sink do? Hold on. Hold on a second. All right, you guys go sleep. Okay, removes germs from duplicates. Okay, so the the washroom basin only does some. Okay, let's see how we're doing on air. Yeah, we can really we can put this anywhere we want. I'm just saying, let's see where where's a place with no germs. Doesn't seem to be really be any over here. Hmm. Yeah, we'll just put it up here for now. I'm pretty sure that's where we had it previously. Just in case. Ah, oh, it's so cool. Oh, who am I gonna put in the neural vacillator? vacillator? I really, I don't, I kind of want to do it in this episode just so you guys can't tell me what it does. <laughs> oh god, Lindsay May, Hassan. Should we grab a new person and make them use it? <laughs> oh, it's, temp it's tempting. Uh, Lindsay's not a horrible character. Hmm, like, welcome to the colony, get in this thing. Yeah. Uh, screw it, let's go with Lindsay, okay. No, uh, she's narcoleptic and ugly crier, that's fine. Hi, Lindsay. Welcome to the colony, Lindsay. Oh, yep, there she goes. Falling asleep already. <laughs> All right. Uh, what are we going to name her? Uh, we're going to name her Logan, just because Logan is a commenter that's been giving me a lot of helpful and useful information in the uh, comments of the videos. All right. Uh, here we go. <laughs> Hold on. I'm definitely not saving. <laughs> in case I want to cheat a little bit. All right. Logan, come on down. 
What is gonna happen? I really do not know. They're still working on the ladders over there. Alright, Logan's coming down. Hopping down. Logan's getting in. And... Oh! Oh no! That Logan's so happy! Oh my god! <laughs> what is it doing to Logan? Oh my god! What is happening? Grab me. Neural facilitation complete. Low oxygen. No, neural vacillation. I don't know what that word is. Oh! Uh, something feels different. Complete neural process. Hold on, we gotta get a screenshot of that. <laughs> okay. Complete neural process. Are you okay? Okay, neural vacillation complete. Woo! Logan's brain is still vibrating, but they've never felt better. Logan acquired the Deeper Diver Lungs trait. Deeper Diver Lungs is duplicate was a talented opera singer and a snorkeling instructor. Air consumption minus 50 GS, or grams per second. Nice! So, she uses... I'm gonna call him he, I know it's it's a girl, but we're just gonna... His name is Logan. Okay, Logan uses less oxygen now. That's pretty cool, there are no charges left. So how do we recharge it? So it gives... So it... I don't know if it just gives a positive trait, it might get, it might be a chance of a positive or negative trait. But in this case, it did give a positive one to Logan. So that's pretty freaking cool. Food shortage. Yo guys, mush bars. Okay. Uh, who are our main chefs? Let's see here. Uh, ba 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 ba. Where's Cook? Cook, okay. Main Cooks. Wyatt. Hey Wyatt, I'm just gonna have you cook. Yeah, I'm sh basically just gonna have Wyatt focus on cooking. Uh, compost, I guess, power, repair, and sweet. No, that's fine. You're good at that. You're good at that. Get to cooking, Wyatt. Where is he? Where are you at, Wyatt? There he is. Okay, he's starting to cook now. You just focus on that, buddy. That's so cool. So will this thing recharge over time? Or is it like a one-time use? Interesting. I'll have to research that. What is this tile? That tile is cool looking. Hey, why didn't you guys wash your hands? They walked by the wash basin and they didn't use it. You little turds. Maybe only one person can use that at a time. That's probably it. That was so cool. I, I'm so glad it didn't kill Logan immediately. That would have been unfortunate. All right, let's go ahead and rummage around in these. Rummage, rummage, rummage. Hopefully nothing horrible happens. All right, Caden opened it and we've got a warm sweater. And another warm sweater. Oh! Now maybe RimWorld has jaded me. When you go and search in like a building like that in RimWorld, there's half a chance that uh like 50,000 alien monsters are going to come flying at your face and shoot it off, but yeah. Okay. We got some sweaters. That's pretty cool. And all of our CO2s going to start dropping down here. There's actually oxygen. That's not horrible. Noise. Oh, now we got some actual idle people. Hmm. Idle hands and whatnot. Okay, let's go ahead and select another research. Improve ventilation, clothing. Let's do artistic expression. I wish to have art. The beautiful list of arts. I'll just put paintings everywhere. And that'll make him happy, you stupid little. Oh, she getting the sweaters? Oh, they're disinfecting. Um, don't really have a reason for them to go down here. So let's go ahead and break that up, and then we're just gonna put a tile here. Maybe an airflow tile, just so we have some <laughs> some more room for CO2 to go. Cause I mean, all that we have down here, we got some more slime. We got some polluted water. We could always revisit, but we don't really need to access this very much right now. Oh, uh, we gotta give, what's her name, her own bedroom. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of that battery. We can just move it down there. Or what's his name? Logan. Logan is a boy, apparently. I just gave him a sex change. His first day in the colony, gave him a sex change and strapped him to a big brain floating in goo. And it made him better at breathing. Yep. Welcome to oxygen not included. <laughs> okay, uh, let's toss an airflow towel right there. And there we go. Okay, that should stop them from going down there. And... Nope! Oh, Jeez, God! Duh! Oh, Caden! Oh, God! That's so, that's so annoying! Okay. Let's try this again. Caden, get the heck out of it. Get out of there, Caden! No, everyone get... Oh my God! Stop going down here! What are they doing? Oh, they're disinfecting stuff. Just, just stop, okay? Just get out of here. Get up here, okay? <laughs> it's so annoying. Go on out of there. Nope. Dark. Oh, stop it. Stop it. Logan's got to get out there. Okay, now do it. Now build it. Build it, please. Nope. Logan, get the hell out of there. It <laughs> just. 
<laughs> what is he doing now? Okay, he's actually building. No! <laughs> Cody! <laughs> How do I, <laughs> I stop? Cody! <laughs> no! <laughs> How do I get them to stop going through there? Okay, you go up here. Cody, you go way over here too. No. Get out of the wall. No! Silver! God! <laughs> Where is he? <laughs> I don't know what to do. Okay, so more get out of there. Oh, there we go, actually. <laughs> Finally got that stupid thing finished. Thank God. Okay, uh, Logan, you, can, you got a bedroom now. That was so dumb, guys, but that's going to be for this episode of Oxygen Not Included. As always, if you enjoyed, make sure to let me know by leaving a like, leaving a comment, leaving something. My voice getting so deep. I'll see you next time. Bye.